Who here remembers when Jameis Winston did this? What about when Jameis Winston did this? <laughs> Man, I can't get enough of Jameis Winston, y'all. In this episode, we're going to talk about not only the growth of New Orleans Saints quarterback Jameis Winston, but also as well why he is my pick, and I'm going to elaborate on this more, why he's my pick for NFL Comeback Player of the Year. Let's get into it. Time to tune in. Now the another sports center. It's a movement. I tell you, when it comes to the football story of New Orleans Saints quarterback Jameis Winston, Talk about a roller coaster of a career from winning the Heisman in college to a national championship, even becoming the NFL passing leader of 2019 and a one time pro bowler. I mean, his statistically, Jameis Winston is not a bad quarterback, but he is destined to have a comeback like you guys have never seen. Now, I love seeing the, 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 the highlights of him in practice, making comedic jabs with reporters. It's on the clip at the beginning of this video. My man was dancing with crushes in the locker room after a victory for the New Orleans Saints. I can't get enough of Jameis Winston. I'm so excited. But we got to remember, this is a guy who went from NFL passing leader, but he was also an interception machine. I mean, Brett Favre 2.0, if you will, um, to take in and go into the rivals team, leaving the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, coming over to the New Orleans Saints and becoming a student of Drew Brees. And Drew Brees himself even took and passed the baton to this man. It's not something that's easy to do, especially as somebody who almost came out of retirement a few times, right? It comes to Jameis Winston, he's somebody who's humble. He's somebody who's hungry. And yes, though the R word that many NFL fans are scared of rebuilding, the Saints are rebuilding, they're almost done with their rebuild. I think one more solid draft and free agency, and they're solid. And just this year alone, with the lack of depth at NFC, they have a real chance of possibly not making the playoffs. But Jameis Winston leading this team through the playoffs and possibly making a huge run and catching the whole world off guard. Jameis Winston, um, and, and I'm going to post some of his stats on the screen right now. What's exciting about this year is that we're going to get a healthy Jameis Winston, somebody who got his LASIK eye surgery done, even though it was a little over a year ago. You know, um, We're going to get somebody who has new weapons, Chris Olave, Jarvis, Landry. Alba Camaro will be gone, but hey, he'll, he'll come in with fresh, fresh legs a few weeks into the season. And Jameis Winston, look, he he is my pick, my pick for comeback player of the year. Uh, not Mitch Trubisky, uh, not any of these other guys. It is Jameis freaking Winston. And New Orleans Saints, you guys got yourself a gem because if this year works out, if this year takes and works out for Jameis Winston, I'm telling you right now, be ready for somebody who is not only going to be cap friendly, you probably get him for a great deal. But also well, somebody who's going to take a fight for you, somebody who is a student of the game, somebody who is a great teammate. And of course, by the clips at the beginning of the video, he's freaking hilarious as well, too. So Jameis Swinson is my pick for comeback player of the year. Comment below. Let me know your thoughts. Maybe you think it's somebody else. Uh, man, let's go. Let's, you know, I, I always chop it up with everybody in the comment section. So you guys have a great night. Catch on the next time. Touchdown, Doug Smith. Time to tune in. Now another sports center. It's a movement.